Yo, what up, my sons? It's DJ Hot Wheels here. Today, I'm I'm going to rap, but not of a, not of a song that was already written. Right now, I'm a freestyle to all these new fake rappers, new rappers out here that are commercial like Drake, Lil Wayne, and all them, calling them out for sucking like this. All right, so I'm starting now. All right. Oh. Yo, I don't care how many record sales you get on your albums, mixtapes, and EPs. Cause y'all niggas soft like, cause y'all niggas suck like spaghetti noodles. Cause y'all niggas suck like spaghetti noodles. Y'all used, y- used to be hood. Most of y'all is from the hood. And then as soon as y'all blew up, the money got to your head and y'all start talking about money, cars, women, and jewelry. About how much you got. You forgot where you came from, that, so that makes you a nobody. Now, Rick Ross, you you fake you fake little wannabe nigga. Your your fat butt and lie to yourself, your family, your friends, and your fans, claiming to be a hustler before you became a rapper. You said you you said you was a hustler and you've been you've been smuggling keys. You talking about you used to shoot people. But you ain't never put a, put your hand on no gun, and you never hustled no keys. You was a prison guard when you before you became a rapper, and then you gonna be represent, then you gonna be screaming Machiavelli trying to represent Pac. Pac, you and Pac ain't even ain't even in the same league, whether he dead or alive. Y'all ain't in the same league. Co's prison co's didn't like Tupac, and didn't like no no criminals. But they ain't that they ain't like nobody who got put in jail. So if Tupac was alive and he knew and when he was rapping and he knew you was a CO, he wouldn't even fool with you no more. So you might as well stop representing Pac. And plus, if you so real and you so hood, you so street. But you but but you you did a publicity stunt faking that you got shot in the drive by. Everybody knows that's a hoax, so don't even play yourself. You fake the sh- you sh- you fake the drive by shooting to get more recognition. You stole your name from the re- from the real freeway Rick Ross, the real the real hustler. And he talking about suing you for stealing his name and persona. And that's why t- one of the Tupac's outlaws, H. Ryder, dissed you on that song on your own beat that you made with Meek Mill. All the stuff that I feel about you right now is how he feels. And if you and you so real, but you not, because this because the, and then because of that song you made called BMF with Styles P, no diss to Styles P because that's my man. No, this ain't about Styles P because I'm because I like his music and I'm cool with him. But because of that song BMF, that is the name of a, that's the initials of a gang leader. And I just seen a video on YouTube, like last, like at the beginning last year, like last year, the gang that the gang that that dude BMF was leading, they sending you death threats on YouTube. <laughs> you just causing trouble. You ain't you ain't no thug, and you just cause trouble for yourself. So now, whenever you go outside, you gotta wa- you better have you gotta have your bodyguards with you. To make sure them gang members don't run up on you, and I ain't a gang member. This is I'm just a dude that makes, I'm just a producer that makes beats and makes video videos on YouTube doing covers of rap songs I know. And Drake, you would you would fight if if someone pushed you to that part. Drake, you would you would you would fight somebody if they pushed you too much. Like you fought Chris Brown, but but when you make music, you sound soft as I don't know what. And I ain't got much to say to you. You suck. I don't like your music. And all, in fact, Drake, everybody from this generation, including you, suck. Everyone except Little Y, Murder Mook, Swerve, Chris Rivers, Vado, and the D Black Boys. All y'all niggas suck. 
And then y'all female rappers now? Y'all dressing too much? Y'all be dressing in so... Y'all be dressing in lesser clothing than you all have been from the beginning. Y'all dressing nearly naked? And in the videos, y'all always be shaking your booty and then on stage, y'all be getting intimate with the fans? Female rappers never used to be like that. They may have been pretty faces, but they still wouldn't show... The, they, they would show people, dudes out here, that they ain't just some pushover. That they ain't just some objects. And y'all are just emphasizing the fact of how some dudes look at y'all. And this ain't no just the women, but you female rappers and singers that be on stage just in half nearly naked and shaking your booties. That's part of the reason. If y'all stop that, then the disrespect for women would stop. And I got respect for women. I'm talking I'm talking about all mothers that don't. I'm stating the obvious. Anyway, all y'all niggas suck. I don't like y'all. Y'all should stop being... Y'all shouldn't even be rappers. Y'all are a disgrace to the name. Y'all never should have came into it. And I can't... I, I ain't even really mad at you rappers for making this whack music about... Bragging about stuff y'all got. Because mostly... It's the fans. It's y'all fans out there. It's your mainstream fans out there that are... That are the problem. You dumb mainstream fans want to hear stuff about money, cars, jewelry, and w and women. And now, and now because that's what y'all like, and that's what y'all buy, they're going to make music like that so they can sell. So it ain't really their fault. It's, it's y'all fault because that's what y'all wanted. Because back in the 90s, people wanted that hardcore gangster street rap. But now the fans have changed and they want, they want that crazy music. So anyway, y'all should stop rapping, and I know y'all not going to, but this is me stating how I feel about it. And I know this don't sound like a rap, because I'm not robbing in every sentence, but that don't matter. I am rapping because of the way I'm saying it. Anyway, and that's all I got to say to y'all, to y'all mainstream fans and mainstream rappers. I need to cut that out. Alright, y'all. Like, like the video. Subscribe to me if you haven't already. And, um, this video is meant for people that know real hip hop and know that these new dudes suck. Not for ones who actually like these new people. And y'all, new people, anybody who's not subscribed to me or never watched my videos, if some of y'all fans of these new rappers, if some of y'all fans of these new rappers, the more power to you. This ain't no disrespect to y'all. It's not. It's not meant as a disrespect to Rick Ross or to or to any of you mainstream fans or any of them. This is just me calling them out for the music not being too good. Because look, when it comes to beef, I don't think there should be beef. But I do think a rapper should call out another one if their music sucks. Like, don't let it get personal. Just just do it business-like for hip-hop. That's all I'm saying. Alright, peace.